to be fast if you're coming in. You've got to be fast. If you want to come in, you come in. I'm the gatekeeper. I want to see what the end result of this is going to be. Yeah. Remember I said that they can't have a meeting if you don't turn up. Very quickly. Quick, 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 quick. No, that's right. They, they don't want to move in. Yeah. The police said that the National Capital Authority have declined to let us stay in here as it's private property. Well, they're just ringing up their boss now to see where they go from there. But if anyone's got any warrants or anything, they've got any warrants, they should leave. <laughs> <laughs> And, uh, 40th and the opposition, Tony Abbott, <laughs> was here. This is where they dined and whined. And then, till the mob found out that they were here, then they come across here and uh, scared them that much. And uh, uh, the Prime Minister lost his slippers <laughs> and they took that. They've shut this place down as a pu uh, public restaurant. Uh, we are taking over, we're taking back what's ours. Uh, it's like a repossession thing. If you don't buy your car or pay your car or whatever it is, your property, we'll move in and take it back. It is a stolen property, it's on stolen land. And, uh, we could say this is an extension of the Aboriginal Tent Embassy. So we'll hang in here and see what happens. And, and he's going to go back and suss that out, and if they can do it tonight, he'll do it tonight. But if not, tomorrow. Is yeah, that. Oh, he's acting chief executive of uh, NCAA. Yeah, he's not a dual citizen, by any chance. We can't take orders from a dual citizen. This is how you start. If we're going up the top of the pack over there, all them dual citizens. The house of cards going to crumble. Yeah, that's yeah. Yeah. Who's this pop that talks? Oh, they're gone in there. Oops. Oh. And then go live, Dad. After that. We're going to have more discussions with the executive director. Of AMCA. In the place. Pardon? In the AFP. In the AFP, sorry, yeah. So At the fire. They, want it, they actually want to work with us to negotiate what our terms are. So, yeah. so we're still that. occupying this place. They on ain't going to do nothing, Noriel. You can just Ooh. stay right <laughs> until Wednesday. <laughs> hey! Did they admit it was vacant Cranley? They didn't know what was going on. They still, they still going back and checking to see what's going on. They don't know. <laughs> All they know is that they've got no jurisdiction over this bit of land. We just told them it's, it's none of all country. They've asserted yeah. their sovereign right here. Embassy? Yeah, and I told them that we the support of the embassy as well. And, you know, support of all our mob coming together. Mm -hmm. Everything that you discussed in that meeting over there, we just <laughs> Barely you mop. Who would have thought you would have seen that? That one. Them driving away and us still here. Still in the same spot. Still in the same spot. And you know how big them fellas would be feeling now? Them two fellas? They wouldn't be feeling big. They'd be, They'd feeling, be feeling this thing. That's smart ass. First thing I'd say to the cops is. I hope you're not a dual citizen, like your boss. <laughs> <laughs>